We are committed to elevating black voices in Colorado's communities, and we are getting a special look inside a new museum showcasing the many accomplishments of black girls and women. It's not only for the eyes, but also a fully immersive experience. Olivia Young got to tour this one of a kind museum, holding its soft opening tonight in Denver. Elevating the stories, experiences, and achievements of black girls and women. It's what Denver's newest interactive museum is all about. And if you come in, you might just learn something new. I'm celebrating black girl magic and giving black girls their flowers. Four years ago, Denver native Charlie Billingsley founded the museum in a friend's boutique. It was supposed to be a one night event that has turned into now a four year um, traveling museum. Today, the museum has a Houston location, pop ups across the country, and soon a permanent location inside the Denver pavilions. It's not your typical museum. You'll hear music, they'll be dancing. Inside, you'll find history, art, and nostalgia. A lot of us grew up getting our hair done in our grandma's kitchen, and the one that we have here is a replica of what my own grandmother's kitchen looked like. As well well as stories that haven't historically been told. Kind of like we say, hidden figures, and that just provides more inspiration to everyone all over that anything is absolutely possible, and we need to see that representation to know that. The museum comes to 16th Street with the help of Pop-Up Denver. Our selection committee was really looking for something that would bring people back downtown, offer them something they couldn't find online, and the Museum for Black Girls is definitely part of um, that trend towards experiential, um, immersive experiences. Bringing representation and education to downtown Denver. We get a lot of black women and girls that come in and they're like, wow, somebody finally sees me. I feel heard, I feel loved, I feel celebrated. The museum's grand opening will be in October and tickets go for $32 for adults and 15 for kids. In Denver, I'm Olivia Young, covering Colorado First.